Brainwise Presence. Primary 3. Science Quiz B. Part 3. Welcome, Curious Minds. Today we're exploring the wonders of science together with 20 awesome questions. Are you ready to become a science superstar? Let's go! Number 1. The plant part that holds it up and carries water to the leaves is the Again. The plant part that holds it up and carries water to the leaves is the The choices are A. Roots B. Flower C. Stem D. Fruit The correct answer is C. Stem The stem is like the plant's backbone and highway providing support and moving water around. Number 2. A key difference between a mango tree and a fern is that a mango tree again. A key difference between a mango tree and a fern is that a mango tree. The choices are A. Has a trunk B. Produces flowers and fruits C. Grows in water D. Has no leaves The correct answer is B. Produces flowers and fruits. Mango trees are flowering plants that produce fruit with seeds inside, while ferns are non-flowering plants that reproduce using spores. Number 3. Animals that do not have a backbone are called. Again, animals that do not have a backbone are called. The choices are A. Vertebrates B. Mammals C. Invertebrates D. Reptiles The correct answer is C. Invertebrates Invertebrates are animals without a spine or backbone, like insects, spiders, and worms. Number 4 a compass needle always points north because again a compass needle always points north because the choices are a north is up b of the sun's position c the earth is a giant magnet d the needle is red The correct answer is C. The Earth is a giant magnet. The Earth has its own magnetic field, like a giant bar magnet. A compass needle aligns with this field, always pointing north. Number 5. In a simple circuit, a gap in a wire will cause the bulb to Again. In a simple circuit, a gap in a wire will cause the bulb to The choices are A. Get brighter B. Get hotter C. Not light up D. Flicker The correct answer is C. Not light up A circuit must be a complete, closed loop for electricity to flow. A gap breaks the circuit, stopping the flow and preventing the bulb from lighting up. Number 6 the process of rocks breaking down into smaller pieces by wind and water is called Again The process of rocks breaking down into smaller pieces by wind and water is called The choices are A. Melting B. Weathering C. Eruption D. Evaporation The correct answer is B. Weathering Weathering is the natural process of breaking down rocks, soil, and minerals through contact with the Earth's atmosphere, water, and living things. Number 7. A non-renewable resource that is gone for a long time once used up is Again. A non-renewable resource that is gone for a long time once used up is The choices are A. Sunlight B. Wind C. Water. D. Coal.
The correct answer is Deed coal. Coal is a fossil fuel that takes millions of years to form. It is non-renewable because we use it much faster than it can be replaced. Number 8. The main function of the circulatory system in a healthy human is to Again, the main function of the circulatory system in a healthy human is to The choices are A. Break down food B. Help us breathe C. Transport oxygen and nutrients through the blood D. Help us move The correct answer is C. Transport oxygen and nutrients through the blood. Number 9. In a simple circuit, if the bulb does not light up, the most likely problem is that the Again. In a simple circuit, if the bulb does not light up, the most likely problem is that the The choices are A. Battery is too strong. B. Wires are too long. C. Circuit is open. D. Bulb is too big. The correct answer is C. Circuit is open. For electricity to flow, it needs a complete, unbroken path. An open circuit means there is a gap, and the electricity cannot make a full loop to light the bulb. Number 10. Tiny openings on a leaf that allow the plant to breathe in air are called Again. Tiny openings on a leaf that allow the plant to breathe in air are called The choices are A. Pores B. Stomata C. Gills D. Holes The correct answer is B. Stomata Stomata are like tiny mouths on the leaves that open and close to let the plant take in carbon dioxide from the air. Great work so far! You're halfway to becoming a science whiz! Ready for the next questions? You've got this! Number 11 A frog, which can live both on land and in water and has a backbone is classified as an Again, a frog, which can live both on land and in water and has a backbone, is classified as an The choices are A. Amphibian B. Reptile C. Fish D. Mammal The correct answer is A. Amphibian. Amphibians are a group of vertebrates that are known for their ability to live in both aquatic and terrestrial environments. Number 12. You have a responsibility to your pet. This means you must. Again. You have a responsibility to your pet. This means you must. The choices are A. Teach it to read. B. Give it food, water, and care. C. Take it to the movies. D. Let it do whatever it wants. The correct answer is B. Give it food, water, and care. Responsible pet ownership means providing for all of your pet's needs to keep it happy and healthy. Number 13. For your heart to be healthy, you should Again For your heart to be healthy, you should The choices are A. Play video games all day B. Eat only candy C. Do regular exercise and eat healthy food D. Sleep for only one hour The correct answer is C. Do regular exercise and eat healthy food. An active lifestyle and a balanced diet are key to keeping your heart strong. 
Number 14. A material that does not allow electricity to pass through it, like the rubber coating on a wire, is called an again. A material that does not allow electricity to pass through it, like the rubber coating on a wire, is called an. The choices are A. Insulator B. Conductor C. Attractor D. Energizer The correct answer is A. Insulator Insulators are used for safety to stop electricity from going where it shouldn't. Number 15. An electromagnet is a special kind of magnet that, again, an electromagnet is a special kind of magnet that, the choices are, A, is always on, B, works only in water, C, can be turned on and off with electricity, D, is made of plastic. The correct answer is C can be turned on and off with electricity. When electricity flows through a wire wrapped around an iron core, it creates a temporary magnet. Number 16. A solar eclipse happens when Again, a solar eclipse happens when The choices are A. The Earth gets between the Sun and Moon B. The Sun gets between the Earth and Moon C. The Moon gets between the Sun and Earth D. The clouds cover the Sun The correct answer is C. The moon gets between the sun and earth. During a solar eclipse, the moon blocks the sun's light from reaching a part of the earth. Number 17. A plant that has a soft, green stem is called a Again. A plant that has a soft, green stem is called a The choices are A. Tree B. Shrub C. Herb D. Vine The correct answer is C. Herb. Herbs are plants that do not have a woody stem. Many kitchen herbs like basil and mint are examples. 18. The sticky liquid in your mouth that helps you soften and swallow food is called Again. The sticky liquid in your mouth that helps you soften and swallow food is called The choices are A. Water B. Blood C. Saliva D. Sweat The correct answer is C. Saliva Saliva, or spit, is produced in your mouth to moisten food and begin the process of digestion. Number 19. The Earth is the third planet from the Again. The Earth is the third planet from the The choices are A. Moon B. Sun C. Star D. Galaxy The correct answer is B. Sun. The order of the planets from the Sun is Mercury, Venus, Earth, Mars, Jupiter, Saturn, Uranus, and Neptune. Number 20. The daily condition of the atmosphere in a certain place is called the Again. The daily condition of the atmosphere in a certain place is called the The choices are A. Climate B. Season C. Weather D. Temperature The correct answer is C. Weather Weather refers to short-term atmospheric conditions like sunshine, rain, or wind, while climate is the weather pattern over a long period. 
Fantastic job! You completed the science quiz. Give yourself a big round of applause. Comment your score and keep exploring the world of science. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. See you next time for more science fun. Check out other videos from BrainWise.